Ladies and gentlemen, boys and girls, welcome to the Mrs. Doctor Who 2013 Doctor Who DVD collection update, this time for August 2014. Now, I know some people have actually been waiting a while for me to do this video, but I've been putting it off and putting it off because I've been getting... i actually got a few DVDs this month. I completed my Hartnell collection, and I also had a mod to the Pertwee and T. Baker shelf, and also I got a few extra as well. So, without further ado... Let's get on with things. I've also done some shifting around with the box sets because as you can see there's none here. I've put some back in their boxes and also the others I've just put on the shelf. So I've only put the chronological ones back in their boxes so as you're going to see so yeah. But first we're going to start out with Doctor Who Lost in Time, a collection of orphan episodes starring William Hartnell and Patrick Troughton. And now we are starting out with the William Hartnell era. Uh, starting things off with the beginning box set. Which has an unearthly child, the Daleks, and the Edge of Destruction with Marco Polo. A 30 minute condensed reconstruction of Marco Polo. So, there we go. Now we're moving on to the others. The Keys of Marinus. The Aztec Special Edition with Galaxy 4. The Sensorites. The Reign of Terror. Planet of Giants, which is new to my collection. The Dalek Invasion of Earth. The Rescue and the Romans box set with... The Rescue and the Romans. Next we have the Web Planet, which is new to my collection. The Space Museum and the Chase box set. With... If these damn things will come out. Sorry. With... The Space Museum. And the Chase. Is that I'm gonna struggle to get them back in? There we are. Anyway, moving on, we have the Time Meddler, which is new to my collection. The Ark, the Gunfighters, the War Machines, and the Tenth Planet. So that's it for the William Hartnell collection. Uh, as you can see, I have got every salvageable William Hartnell DVD. Because, of course, a lot of Hartnell episodes are still missing, particularly from Season 3. So, let's move on to the second Doctor, Patrick Troughton. Also, with a lot of missing episodes. Particularly from Season 4 and 5. The Moon Base. Tomb of the Cybermen Special Edition, The Ice Warriors, The Enemy of the World, The Web of Fear, The Dominators, The Man Jobber, The Invasion, The Crotons, The Seeds of Death Special Edition, and the war games. So that does it for the Patrick Troughton collection. Not many out on DVD. But now we're moving on to the third Doctor, my favourite, John Pertwee. Spearhead from Space Special Edition. Doctor Who and the Silurians. The Ambassadors of Death, which is new to my collection. Inferno Special Edition, which is new to my collection. Terror of the Autons, 
Colony in Space, which is new to my collection. Day of the Daleks. The Curse of Peladon. The Sea Devils. The Three Doctors Special Edition. Carnival of Monsters Special Edition. The Time Warrior. Invasion of the Dinosaurs. Death to the Daleks. The Monster of Peladon. And Planet of the Spiders. So that does it for the John Pertwee era. Uh, still got a few more to get there. Of I have all of Season 7 and Season 11. So moving on to the fourth Doctor, Tom Baker. We have Robot. The Ark in the Space Special Edition. The Sun Tower Experiment. Genesis of the Daleks. Revenge of the Cybermen. Terror of the Zygons. Planet of Evil. Pyramids of Mars. The Android Invasion. The Brain of Morbius. The Seeds of Doom. The Deadly Assassin. The Face of Evil. The Robots of Death Special Edition. The Talons of Wang Chiang Special Edition. Horror of Fang Rock. The Invasion of Time. The Key to Time box set. With the Reboss Operation. The Pirate Planet. The Stones of Blood, the Androids of Tara, the Power of Crawl, and the Armageddon Factor. <sighs> Flipping heck. Hate doing this with one hand. Sorry, I just had to use two hands there to get the arm again and back to backing, so... Yeah. But... Does it for the key to time. Moving on. So the only three stories I have from season 17. Destiny of the Daleks. City of Death. Sharda, which is new to my collection. Now we're moving down to the next row, starting Tom Baker's final season, season 18. By the way, I now have a complete one from Sharda to the time of the Doctor. So, yeah, everything from here on out is going to be complete. The Leisure Hive. Megalos. The East Space Trilogy. With Full Circle. State of Decay and Warriors Gate. I'm gonna have to use the two hands here. This is. Eh, it could be worse to be honest. At least I'm getting on with it. Then we have the New Beginnings box set. Ending off the Tom Baker era with The Keeper of Traken. And Logopolis, and kicking off the Peter Davison era with Castrovalva. I have to use two hands for this again just to make things easier and quicker. Ah, but yeah, so that does it for the Tom Baker era. I have all of seasons 12, 13, 16, and 18. Uh, but I'm pretty close to completing uh, season 14 in particular. I plan to get the Mask of Mandragora and the Hand of Fear next to complete uh, that season. So let's move on to the fifth. Uh, yeah, we start at the fifth Doctor with Pete Davidson. Let's continue. Fort to Doomsday. 
Kinder. The Visitation Special Edition. Black Orchid. Earth Shock. Time Flight and Arc of Infinity. With Time Flight and Arc of Infinity. Why is it never easy, eh? Anyway, then we have Snake Dance. Now, we have the Black Guardian Trilogy next, which usually I would keep in the box set, but unfortunately I've had to split these DVDs onto two separate shelves, so... Oh, flipping heck. I made a big mistake. Put one DVD in the wrong place. Put the King's Demons where Mordor and Dead should be, so... Let me just fix that real quick. Didn't even realise that. <laughs> I apologise deeply, but anyway. Usually we would have the Black Guardian Trilogy box set here, but I've had to split the DVDs onto two separate shelves, so we've just got the DVDs. Uh, Modern and Dead. Terminus. Enlightenment. Anyway, then we have... So that's Black Guardian Trilogy. Next we have The King's Demons. The Five Doctors 25th Anniversary Edition in its sleeve with the actual DVD there. So, yeah. Keep that in its sleeve now. Not with the other box sets. It's funny because uh, I think the sleeve is edition is actually quite rare now, but... Yeah, I think maybe I should have moved one of the DVDs onto the next row, but... You know what? That's what I'm going to do, just to make things easier. Yeah, sorry, I've done a bit of shifting around whilst making this video, but... Anyway, let's just move on. Warriors of the Deep. The Awakening. I'm recording! Bye. Sorry about that, my mum interrupted. Anyway, uh, let's pretend nothing happened there. Pretend I didn't get interrupted. We have the Five Doctors, Warriors of the Deep, The Awakening, Frontios, Resurrection of the Daleks Special Edition, Planet of Fire, The Case of Androzani Special Edition, The Twin Dilemma, Attack of the Cybermen, Vengeance on Baros Special Edition, The Mark of the Rani, The Two Doctors, Time Lash, Revelation of the Daleks. Usually we'd have the Trial of the Time Lord box set here, but as you can see, I've had to split them into two separate shelves again, so The Trial of the Time Lord, The Mysterious Planet. The Trial of a Time Lord Mind Warp. The Trial of a Time Lord Terror of the Vervoids. The Trial of a Time Lord The Ultimate Foe. So, oh yes, I forgot to mention we uh, finished the uh, Peter Day's era there. We just did the uh, Colin Baker era. Now moving on to the 7th Doctor, Sylvester McCoy. Time of the Rani. Paradise Towers. Delta and the Bannerman, Dragonfire, Remembrance of the Daleks Special Edition, The Happiness Patrol, Silver Nemesis, The Greatest Show in the Galaxy, Battlefield, Ghost Light, The Curse of Fenric, Survival. So that does it for the uh, Sylvester McCoy era. Then we have the 1993 40th anniversary documentary here. More than 30 years of the TARDIS, which is new to my collection. And we have the entire Paul McGann era in one DVD, one story. Doctor Who the Movie Special Edition. Now you're moving on to the revived series, with, starting with the 9th Doctor, Christopher Eccleston. 
Series 1 Volume 1, Series 1 Volume 2, Series 1 Volume 3, Series 1 Volume 4. That's the ninth Doctor era. That's all Chris Freckleton did, believe it or not. Now moving on to the 10th Doctor David Tennant with Doctor Who the Complete Second Series without the sleeve. Doctor Who the Complete Third Series. Doctor Who the Infinite Quest. Do uh, there we have Doctor Who Voyage of the Damned. Series 4 Volume 1. Series 4 Volume 2. Series 4 Volume 3. Series 4 Volume 4. <sighs> Doctor Who the Complete Specials. And Doctor Who Dreamland. So that does it for the David Tennant era. Now moving on to the 11th Doctor, Matt Smith. Doctor Who the Complete 5th Series. Moving down to the next row we have... Doctor Who the Complete 6th Series. The Doctor, the Widow and the Wardrobe. Series 7 Part 1A. Series 7 Part 1B. Series 7 Part 2A. Series 7 Part 2B. An Adventure in Space and Time, which is new to my collection. I actually picked this up yesterday. Didn't do an unboxing of it, but I will show it off in my next unboxing. So, yeah. Then we have Doctor Who, The Day of the Doctor. Doctor Who, The Time of the Doctor, with other 11th Doctor Christmas specials. Then we are moving on to the spin-off series, which, um, so far the only spin-off series I have is the Sarah Jane Adventures. I'll be getting Torchwood and maybe K9 shortly, but for now... It's just the Sarah Jane Adventures. Sarah Jane Adventures are complete first series. The Sarah Jane Adventures are complete second series. The Sarah Jane Adventures are complete third series. The Sarah Jane Adventures are complete fourth series. And the Sarah Jane Adventures the fifth series. And over here you have my box sets. Which so far the ones I have are uh, Mannequin Mania with Spearhead from Space Special Edition in Terror of the Autons, Peladon Tales, The Curse of Peladon and Monster of Peladon. If it'll get back in. Ah, fuck. I hate it. I hate it. I hate it when this happens. I hate it. I hate it. I hate it. Anyway. Mara Tales with Kinder and Snake Dance. Chameleon Tales with the King's Demons and Planet of Fire. Ace Adventures with Dragonfire and the Happiness Patrol. And Beneath the Surface with... I just try flipping it over. Beneath the surface with Doctor and the Silurians, the Sea Devils, and Warriors of the Deep. This is a shelf is a nightmare. Unit files with Invasion of the Dinosaurs and the Android Invasion. Revenge of the Cybermen and Silver Nemesis with Revenge of the Cybermen and Silver Nemesis. The Legacy Collection, which is new to my collection, with uh, Shadow and More Than 30 Years in the TARDIS. Bread for War, the Sontaran Collection, with the Time Warrior, the Sontaran Experiments, the Invasion of Time, the Two Doctors. Earth Story was the Gunfighters and the Awakening. The Black Guardian Trilogy with Mordred and Dead, Terminus and Enlightenment. And The Trial of a Time Lord with a Mysterious Planet, Mind Warp, Terror of the Vervoids and the Ultimate Foe. 
with the Series 7 Part 1 Limited Edition with Series 7 Part 1A and Part 1B. Series 7 Part 2 with Series 7 Part 2A and Part 2B. Revisitations 1 with the Talents of Wen Chang, the Case of Andrew Zani and Doctor Who the Movie Special Editions. Revisitation 2 with the Seeds of Death, Carnival Monsters and Resurrection of the Daleks Special Editions. Revisitations 3 with the Tomb of the Cybermen, the Three Doctors and the Robots of Death Special Editions. And that does it for my Doctor Who DVD collection. Update as of uh, August 2014. Yeah, I know. Uh, getting pretty close to completing my collection now. I have 17 more classics. 18 if the underwater mice does come out. Right, I have 18 more classics to get. Uh, the next. DVDs I plan to get are The Mask of Mandragora and The Hand of Fear to complete season 14 for Tom Baker. Uh, what else do I plan to get? Oh, yeah. Uh, I also. Um, I know Deep Breath's coming out on DVD, but I'm not bothering to get that. Waiting for the complete 8th series. And, well, I won't get that if. Um, as soon as it comes out in individual volumes or vinyl releases, with them, um, if 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 the complete eight series comes out with the day of the Doctor and the time of the Doctor, which if it doesn't, I'll be getting the complete eight series. But if it does, I'll get series eight and vinyl releases if there are any. So there's that. Although I doubt they will because they've just re they're releasing the 50th anniversary Clets edition shortly, where you have to read by the name of the Doctor. <sighs> if you have already have a complete seventh series, but it's gonna be that for now. It's Miss Doctor Who from Thirteen saying word out, and uh, see you next time in my next review, probably. If not, and probably my first impressions on Deep Breath or something like that. Miss Doctor Who from Thirteen saying word out.